root structures on a tree that has drunk too much vodka and is weeping, bent over like a hunch that suspects but knows nothing. I have learned that you can freeze out the cold before the cold outfreezes you. That trying to achieve freedom means defining it, crystallizing it, imprisoning it, failing it. That everything is alive with meaning and that the most advanced language doesn't use words with sensory experiments. That you can make love with the ocean, with a footprint. The friction of those two seconds slipping past you like two bodies in an elevator can raise an eyebrow, a heartbeat. That we are so close right now that I just can't quite speak it. Multilingual dead languages are reborn into the next karmic cycle and the jokes on us. Human utterances. All of them are at the bottom of the hierarchy. Conversations are all hoping that when they burp their last death gasp, that they will come back in the next life as a dance move, a lover's caress, an epileptic fit, the taste of laughter, a skinned knee, the sweetness of oranges at Christmas time, static electricity. So, kiss me, somebody, anybody, kiss me, and let something have the pleasure of evolving tonight, even if it isn't us. I have learned that sleep isn't essential. I have learned that wonder can't be stuffed down a rabbit hole. I have learned that to some, constant crises are beautiful. I have learned that really, it's all pretty inconsequential, unless, of course, you let your fear control you. I have learned that you can break over a wave before the wave breaks over you. And then when the sky makes love with the ocean, swimming is flying too. I've been to hell and back twice. I've been to hell and back twice. Me so far, all stands on on all four. Daddy, this is so bien bien, my vie. I tell you, it's a level, crayon, or it's a level. Oh, and set the book on all treasure and take on feet. I've been to hell and back twice. I do upside down huts, new galaxies tearing apart, grand horns against each other. I would always find my brother touching up the light into a kaleidoscope of colors and shapes of infinity. Are you reading my mind? Arrows pointing up, roller discos spinning in circles. The merry-go-round became a bicycle that we could all ride. Robots looking back at me in the mirror. I wish the robots could kiss you. Their lasers removed tattoos like mistakes I couldn't remove from my memory. I drew spells. I spelled definitely with an I. We pressed for a while. But not friendly ones, but from this pen on the wall. No one person is greater than the other. It's the god damn god. Mother waterfalls and the power of cracks. I've slipped through the cracks again. The power of cracks. The power of cracks. I've been to hell and back twice. The power of cracks. The x ray vision or heat beam eyes, I think that even without them, we tend to burn bridges more often than we realize. I remember watching the old movie, seeing Superman, a person not from this planet, spit the earth backwards to fix his mistakes. And even though I knew it was fake, I thought that I would be sent if I could do what he did and live. A life without regret. But I grew up with Hollywood happy endings and predictable plot twists. I never thought that life would end up like this. I've spent too many nights, eyes, blood, shot with regret, tracing back disappointment to crappy cliches with hope that one day I'd be able to run 88 miles an hour with a flux capacitor strapped to my back, taking off like a train track, smack in the middle of the pass, and th that there, I'd know what was coming. I no longer feel the need for forgiveness or redemption, no longer feel the need to learn from stupid things like my own mistakes, and, and best of all, no one out there can make me break. Because as much as I know how often we need to fall 
in order to stand, how fragile mirrors can be, and how easily we see reflections fracture when the things we care about fall apart, like, like people. As much as I know how we can't be something more, something better than this, I know I've always wanted to be bulletproof that the tears of people I made cry didn't sting like shrapnel scars and they bounced off me like pebbles instead of filling my ribcage with lead that it wouldn't feel so heavy anymore that maybe I could fly if it weren't for this damned grab man wish the sky would open up and take me pulling me past the clouds not worry about falling back down I wish it would swallow me whole just so I wouldn't have to face this truth I know I've never been bulletproof my proof leads from every bullet hole and every broken heart the sky taught me a thing about healing, but it was the ground I would listen. She was there whenever I fell ready to catch me with fissure kisses and hands all stretched in the valleys and sides of the lullabies. She whispered in her telling me that sometimes we need to break in order to heal. So even when I wanted to see even when I wanted to be full of and travel back in time, even when I wanted to fly, the soil would start to feel so heavy in my veins that at first I'd be angry. Having been grounded, my wings clipped and bound to the earth. It was her way of reminding me that sometimes, sometimes humor is all we can do. Down on schoolies, toolies, and boolies, crack down on potheads and crackheads. Blitz the bingers! Graffiti bombing is a weapon of mass destruction. Crack down on ecstasy. Crack down on orgasm. Underage orgasm. It's a crack house, no vacancies. Crack down on financial derivatives. Tax the cracks. The Queen orders a crackdown. Crack down on terrorists. Crack down on nuclear power. Bring out the secret police. ID checks for a walk in the mall. Crack down on crack down. It's all gonna crack. Put cold blocks of concrete in the middle of the roads. No entry signs at Queensland's borders. Demand one-way streets with dead ends. Tax, tax, tax the crackers. Close the clubs at 3 a.m. No, close the clubs at midnight. You can't drink out of that glass, sir. It's, it's not plastic. No, just close the clubs for good. Blitz the bingers. In Queensland, we dance in silence. You can dance alone in silence. Thank you.